the long-awaited Malaysia-Singapore High-Speed Rail Agreement has officially been inked. Minister in the Prime Minister's Department, Dato Abdul Rahman Dalan, and Singapore's Transport Minister, Khor Boon Wan, signed the agreement during the 7th Malaysia-Singapore Leaders' Retreat on Tuesday afternoon. The signing ceremony was witnessed by both Prime Minister Datuk Sri Najib Tun Razak and Singaporean Prime Minister Lee Hsien Loong. I know people are excited about it. Um, the towns along the way will definitely see uh, a marked uh, uh, improvement in terms of its economic uh, activities. And uh, uh, definitely this project will uh, open a new uh, landscape in terms of our bilateral relations. So, we're looking forward to its uh, implementation according to the schedule and we think that uh, we will be able to deliver it according to the timeline that we have committed to between our two sides. I'd like to thank particularly the ministers, Corbin Wan on my side, Dr. Ramandalan on the Malaysian side, and before that, uh, his predecessor, for their, uh, who was Dr. Wahid, for their very hard work in the negotiations and for landing the agreement. And now we have to implement the agreement. It's a long way to go yet because it's a complex project and we're making long-term commitments. But there's a strong political will on both sides to ensure the project is done right and is a success. And I look forward to taking my first train ride up to Putrajaya in 10 years' time. The document is a follow-up to a MOU signed by both countries on July 19th and outlines plans and details for the development of the expensive rail project. The 350-kilometre rail line starts from Bandar Malaysia in Kuala Lumpur and ends at Jurong East in Singapore with six transit stations in Putrajaya, Seremban, Ayakero, Muar, Batu Pahat and Iskandar Putri. Both countries put a date of operation sometime in 2026.